last much longer. Pay dearly for that. No, no, no. no Please no, spare no. my life. I will not last much longer. will pay dearly for that. Bloody bastards! I will not last much longer.
Must watch where I step. I've done it. My past is erased, and I can join the Cabal. What the... Ophelia? What's going on? Hey, what are you doing in my story? Where am I? Uh, some kind of frat house. Oh, wait. No, it can't be. <laughs> um, uh, you're having a bad dream, Caleb, dear. Just a nightmare. I don't think so, sister. Oh no, it's happening again. Well, I suppose it is my turn, yes? My, my. Like Ophelia, I have a secret. 
Doubtlessly, you two have heard of Jojo, the idiot circus boy. Of course. <laughs> when I was a child, my papa would take me to the freak show every year. And every year I would see Jojo. I used to throw little clumps of dirt at him. Ahem, <clears throat> yes. Well, I remember that. You see, I was Jojo. Unemployment did not cover evil cultists in those days, and the only place an out-of-work tattooed man could find work was the circus. So, for a time, I became Jojo. The previous Jojo passed on the revered mantle of Jojo-ness to me, and it was with proud grace that I strutted out onto the stage on my first day. Then, bastard little dirt throwers like yourself taught me what it really was to be a freak. After a year of that, I was a prisoner to my own low self-esteem. One day, though, it all changed. Chernobog spoke to me and did bid me to free myself of this mortal mockery. And so I did. But it was not easy. Ishmael, listen. Jojo hears, Master. You are Jojo no longer. Go, kill these mortals and come to my side. We have much work to do. Jojo hears and obeys, Master. 